And now, your first alert weather. It's Monday, July the 13th, and there's one lonely cloud in Pocatello. We're, so we're just going to ask him to swipe right. We'll find, find somebody to hook up with, right? 76 in sunshine right now in Pocatello. Winds are out of the southwest at about 18. The sun will go down tonight at 9.08. We get those clouds out of here with this breeze today. It's 71 in Idaho Falls right now, and that brisk wind will continue. We've got a lake wind advisory for the American Falls Reservoir, and we also have a long line at Chick-fil-A again today. Uh, by the way, folks, there is no Chick-fil-A in West Yellowstone or Yellowstone. This is the West Gate. Look at the travelers coming in there, man. They have picked a great day to join us here. This is a red flag warning for part of our area, and that means you should not be burning anything. We got breezes of up to 30 miles an hour with that Lake Wind Advisory as well in the American Falls Reservoir area. 67 in Driggs. It is 66 in Jackson, 65 in Salmon, and we're in the 50s and 60s into the parks right now as we get that last little bit of cool air out of here and warm up for the afternoon. We're in the 70s for the most part. You can see some of the breezes, 17, 16, 18 miles an hour into Pocatello out of the west in Burley at 16 miles an hour. These are the last hour gusts. So we've seen 20 plus. We've seen 31 mile an hour gust into Pocatello and this will continue into the afternoon. It's going to clear the clouds out and here's the forecast with our wind cast and you'll see that yeah things kind of die down overnight. We'll have some more breezes that trickle in here for Wednesday, but it's not going to disrupt any kind of sunshine. It's going to be really nice. Your viper cast looks like this. There's that uh, red flag warning. It will expire tonight. High pressures in control to our north breezes and they'll clear out tomorrow. It's going to be a really nice Nice sunny Tuesday. Temperatures cool down just a little bit here. We get back to Wednesday and we start ramping up toward 90 degrees again for the weekend. You likey? Yeah, just swipe right. 75 in Afton, 77 soda and lava, 79 approaching 80 in burn. It'll be in the low to mid 80s along the coast of Idaho. We get to Jackson, it'll be 72, 74 in Dubois. We're approaching 80 right here through Rexburg and St. Anthony and 77 in Ashton. A little cooler in the parks. It'll be in the upper 70s to around 80 for the central Idaho mountains and still cool overnight tonight in the 40s and 50s for most of us. The site, IF Blackfoot, all at 82 Aberdeen at 83 cooler in American Falls with that lake wind advisory through here and yes be careful if you're on the water 80 choppy seas as we like to say yes if you're taking the Snake River Ferry later uh, make sure you have on a life jacket and a Gilligan hat 83 in Pocatello all right here's your local news eight day extended forecast with a breezy afternoon ahead we'll hit 48 tonight then 79 tomorrow with sunshine it'll be breezy on into Wednesday and 84 getting toward 90 by Thursday and Friday and looks like a really nice drop dry uh, weekend and it will be warm. Great for outside stuff. Pocatello, the clouds apart and we'll see 83 later on this afternoon, 82 for tomorrow and then we're on the highway to 92 degrees for Thursday and Friday. We'll keep it in the 90s for Saturday as well with mostly sun. Blackfoot, we're headed toward 82 today. 47 tomorrow morning when you wake up with us here on Local News 8 and the big three, it'll be 79 Tuesday and then windy for Wednesday in 84, closer to 90 by the wrap up of the week. Rexburg, it'll be 80 and then we'll see 77 tomorrow. Clouds begin to shift out of here and things are looking nice and dry. We'll have a slight chance of some moisture around for Friday and Saturday, but it should be nice this weekend. We're in the upper 80s. Salmon 77 today, nice tomorrow. Lots of blazing sun in 79, windy into Wednesday. Then we're going to approach 90 degrees and we'll keep that thermostat up there as we head toward the weekend. Your forecast is always online at localnews8.com. Download the app too wherever you are. We'll keep you up to date on warnings and watches and of course temperatures as well anytime. It'll be 76. The clouds will break some today in Jackson and it'll be 74 tomorrow, 76 for Wednesday and then we're into the 80s for the end of the weekend. Don't go anywhere. Local News 8 at noon.